Hi everyone and welcome to another episode of our Mega Hood series. We have a tree burning here. Okay, fixed. So this is the last episode of this rotation and we're starting with Cap Monty family. We'll have some birthdays here, like like three birthdays. Adults won't age up yet, but their kids will. Okay, I haven't had that bug happen in the main game in ages. I usually had it in life stories or something. Okay, go put the train her. Okay, she's almost done. She learned it, okay. So only this little guy is left and we're good. Wait, I just realized the viola is aging up today. I thought it was tomorrow, but yeah, it's today. Okay, she'll age up soon and I wonder what aspiration she could get. Let's see what you've got. How you'll look like. I guess I'm gonna give her like popularity maybe. Pleasure? No, pleasure not really. I think I'll go with popularity. And she has somewhat nice outfits, so I'll keep it. Okay, these turn ons don't seem like you'd have a nice partner. So that's how she looks like. She seems more similar to Kent, but I don't mind, it looks fine on her. Yeah, her her face looks fine on her. That That's something smart to say. I want to give her some dark lipstick because I always keep using the same ones, but I don't really like how they look. I mean, I prefer the lighter ones, but it doesn't match her, I guess. I'll go with this one. And what about your outfit? You have this, okay. Looking nice. Don't sleep like that, you have bed. I'll let you teach the kid. Okay. You finally learned. Okay, I, I just realized you probably shouldn't do your homework like that often because you are quite lazy and... And yeah, and you're a popular system. You want to own top 5 you want to own five top level businesses. I don't like that lifetime once so I'm most likely gonna reroll it. I like when my sims get random ones, but that one is not the one I like. Also I just noticed also I just noticed Kent got promoted. So that's cool. You wanted him to get and he got. Does that mean the career reward? Yes it does. And I just noticed she finished her homework. I wanted her to stop, but I forgot to to pay attention. Caius and Celia. That's how you spell their names, I hope so. I like naming kids stuff and then not remembering how to pronounce it. Okay, you managed to be friends. Call her again so it doesn't go away. Never mind. Kent got a promotion because of that. And he still has enough skills to get another one. Okay. Alright, 6 pm. So go everyone to the biggest space. No, not the crib, not to the crib. I know she's pretty tired, but who cares? No! And to the wrong one, of course. No, 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 no. Go relax. You can go here and you can grow up, because then everyone will be busy with watching you grow up. And now you can grow up as well. Okay, first one is up. He looks unusual. And what about you? You also look quite formal. I mean, if that's what you want to dress your kids, then okay. Okay, that's Caius. He looks pretty cute. I'll give him that hairstyle. Like if his parents tried to make him look serious. That's his sister. She looks a little more odd. She doesn't look bad, but she looks for sure more odd. And okay, what's your outfit? Nothing really matching, I see. I mean, this matches the most, but that's what your sister has, most likely. She has this. 
but I assume that's what Viola had. But yeah, she's gonna have this, and then you can have the serious out, the more normal outfit, like this. And we're all good now. Okay, that's how it's gonna be. Don't jump on bed, you are too tired, you can go sleep here, you can go sleep here, and you can clear all, so you can sleep here. Actually, everyone can go to sleep now, I guess. It's not best setting, but it's some setting. We have to live like that for at least few more days, until Viola ages up. Or when we get some money for new house. Because I consider moving them out, them out. I'll see after this episode. If they'll have enough money, then next rotation will be at new place. But if not, then yeah, we'll still be here for some time. But if can't get in promotions so fast, then I don't, I don't think it will take long. Okay, so it's morning and snow day. So I guess. Everyone could go to work today because kids gonna stay with the viola But yeah, it's 7 a.m. on Friday. So let's just go to the to the next family so we're playing loners now and I must admit it's funny how the seasons change like every everywhere is winter, but sometimes it's summer Glaive was supposed to be with how yeah How did finish college? I think he did, but I'm unsure now. Invite household, let me see who he lives with. With Gonroll. Okay. Let's invite them both. You don't know Gonroll, I think. Oh, and I think you won't meet her because she's not coming. I think I'm gonna move these two together in this episode. Like, not really in this episode, but after this episode I'm gonna move Glaive out and she's gonna live with Hal from then. And maybe the next situation don't get married. Like, I know they wanna and stuff, but... I mean, they do have a want, but they are engaged and... Yeah. Why you don't want to teach him how to walk? Why? He isn't in the wrong place, it's quite plenty of room if I have to say so. Yeah, now it works. Okay, he learned something. That's really good, now let's learn some more. Nice. Now he just has to learn how to talk and we're good. Oh, politics. Something for you. Let's see what type of wish would you make. Like... Resurrect. Who do you know? Glarn. It's like... The most expected option. These three are just people you met when you were alive. And this is... And this is... Cersei's grandpa for some reason. Okay, I was just curious who you could resurrect. Glarn is, an, Glarn is an unexpected one, but I don't think you would want to bring him back if he like, if you two broke up and he got for another girl, and then you died, or the other way around. I'm I don't know. Learning stuff from books goes quite fast, I noticed, especially from that custom one. I mean, it's not custom, it's a carry reward. But still. It's fun, you can learn the stuff you can't normally. Like charisma or... Or body. Teach the kid how to talk in the meantime. Okay, now he knows everything. Go back to your charisma. <laughs> I'm gonna get a promotion tomorrow if it goes well, and I hope it does, because you have not many points to learn, and with that bookshelf it goes really, really quickly. 
and Lola got a promotion, just like I said. And she isn't far from next one either, so that's really good. Oh, wow, he learned four logic points in no time. Anyway, let's look for a job just casually because I'm curious if you if you're gonna find something that pays more. Mm, no. Oh, military. You can have same job at lower level. <laughs> okay, it's 7 a.m. So time to go to another family, but the dog. Okay, the dog went away. And it seems like Lola is about to have a next logic point, so maybe she'll get a promotion next episode, who knows. But now it's time to go to the last family. Not really the last family, because we still have a college, but yeah, last family. Alright, our last family, all playing with Melissa Fancy and her kid, little Leon. She's still young, so I think she could have a partner, but I see she for now knows only townies, so I don't know. Maybe I'll pair her with one of these townies, but I don't want to. I don't really like pairing uh, townies with other townies, so I don't know yet. Wait, why are you here? You are supposed to be at school. I just now realized. Will you wake up today? No, it doesn't seem like so. I like how... I like how Melissa is still kinda treated like a... Like a roommate. Like, I know she's clearly not a roommate, but she for some reason is on the sidebar. Okay, by looking at the fact how much money we have left, I don't think you can afford going to work. Did you bring any money? Like we lost 300 and... Oh yeah, you don't bring money because something is bugged. Yeah, okay. We should probably get you out of this place, I guess. You seem to get along quite well. Go hang out with the other guy, so you have more options. She just casually left her kid alone, okay. I hope you at least bring some food. You didn't bring anything. I know you're too hungry, but you can eat at school. <laughs> okay, don't finish the homework, let's stay that way. She doesn't have inventory, she doesn't have anything. Can kids dig for treasure? No, they can't. So we don't have any way of income. Because she's bugged, unless I would just cheat the money every day she comes back, but I don't feel like it for some reason. Okay, I may do it, so let's look for a job. Music. Sounds good. One hundred and one hundred and eight. Just a small visit. Okay, it seems to go somewhere. And that was Goopy's first kiss, okay. I don't mind, I don't judge, but okay. Oh, he's in love now. Not try for baby, I almost clicked it. But no, I don't want to try for baby yet. Okay, it's 7 a.m. So it's time to go to the university, because we finished rotation. And we may consider moving them out, them out of here in the next or other rotation. Because yeah, that took me a while to finally get here, but yeah, we're finally in college again. And we have three more years to play. So, so as I just checked, oh, declare major. As I checked, everyone except Maddie will be graduated by that time. But she won't be alone here, we have two more students in the bin. You probably know them because you watch the series, obviously. <laughs> okay, she would be in economics because she wants to get uh, into the business career. Oh, she wants to resurrect Jenny. 
Oh. I don't know if that's gonna happen, but yeah. Her parents are dead, and all her siblings are green, I just realized. Wow. Also, Maddie was supposed to be with someone here, or she has no partner. I'm unsure, so I won't focus on her dating life. I may change her appearance after this rotation or at the end of it, because, well, she wants to become a business tycoon and she looks like not really. We want to resort trip. Hmm. I'm not... I don't know how you know he died. I'm not sure how to... How to make that connection. Because nobody knows he died. But okay. I like how long it takes to play college, but most of it is cut anyway. <laughs> like... I'm playing for quite a while now, but it's probably just a few seconds for you. Why do you want a guitar? Why did I lock that in for you? So I guess I could buy something here. Everybody passed, of course. Great tie because he's a primate and you are adopted, so... Maybe you could have something. Ah, he's neutral. Okay. Okay, so I assume Alexander will finish his assignment and then we'll go. Okay, his assignment took less than I thought, so let's let's watch the thing and then we'll go to the exam. Okay, everyone went. In this year we're not moving anyone in, so we're just gonna get few less students. Alexander was for sure about to move back to his Goff house, so he won't take too much money. I wanted Benedict to move back with his dad, but his dad moved out, so he has to get house on his own. I don't want him in peasant house. And the back? I don't remember what I had for back. That's... that's not what you're gonna wear, so no worries. Move out now, no, because I want to plan outfit for you. Okay, let's give you what you had, so like this, I guess. Yeah, I don't remember pants, but let's go with this one, because I use this too often and they are too dark. Alexander's in the meantime picking his outfits. And Beatrice is gonna age up. Ah, she doesn't look too bad, I guess. I'm not gonna show them in the mirror because you saw them as a young, you saw them as young adults and they look identical. I'll give them the same outfits because I'm not too creative and she could get regular pants for present, but I'm gonna keep this one. Okay, time for Benedict. He looks quite official. I don't remember if he had light red or dark red. I'll go with dark because it looks better in my opinion. I don't think I'll change the... Okay, I will change Buck's outfit. I was about to say I won't because he wants to buy new clothes anyway, but... Yeah, here he's dubbed into this. So I, I will change his look anyway, but I want him to wear something decent for some time. Like this maybe, at least. I'll change it, but I want something decent. Let's continue our university with just four sims. Oh, it's Ashley. I wonder if you have chemistry. I really want to pair Maddie with a pre-made, but I don't know who. You don't seem to have anything, or you do, you have one bolt. Alright, I'll keep that in mind and you're gonna hang out, get to know each other better. To make it a little more interesting. I'm just gonna make them woohoo, because why not. You have chemistry with her? You are bi? What now? I don't think I remember that, but okay. I'm fine with it. 
Yeah, I don't expect too much to happen on the university. I'm just trying to speedrun it. And I'm mostly silent anyway. I like how Bo almost has maxed out his education, so I technically could skip. But everybody else doesn't even have term papers started. So yeah. Alright, we're good now, I guess. Let's firstly move these two out. I forgot what colors did you have. But I like this one on you, so I'll assume you had it. Oh, I forgot about her needs, so she grew up badly. What did you wear? I already forgot. <laughs> oh, this thing. Because you looked nice in it. I think I'll keep this one, though. I'll change the pants and everything else is fine. Okay, bottom is gonna take 20,000 for her new house. And Jill is not gonna sit on the chair, but move out. Yes, move out now. She has her big house, so I just realized that she didn't have to take the fortune. I mean that uh, Benedict didn't have to take the fortune. But anyway, let's move Ariel here. So we moved. So we moved Ariel in here, and that's how she looks like. I think I'll keep that outfit for her university. She's a fortune sim, so it kind of suits her, I guess. Alright, that's how she looks like as an adult. She looks pretty decent. Is anything good for being a thief? A criminalist even? I don't see anything, so let's go with, with economics, I guess. No, economics now. Because we have many sims in the psychology. She wants to have a very first kiss. So I guess I could think about that. I guess you can have your first kiss now. Because that seems to be something you really want. Okay, now say goodbye to everyone. Because you don't seem to want more. Greet that guy. I have no idea if you know him, but he's a pre-made, so it may be good to know him. Negative chemistry, ask to leave everyone. Okay, time for exam. If this episode is late, which I'm pretty sure it will be, I hope it won't, but I'm pretty sure it will, it's because of the university. It took me a lot of days to record, and I won't mention how long it took me to edit because I didn't start yet. I feel other with the fact that Bo is finishing college now. Like, he was a toddler at the start, but okay. I will feel even weirder when the born in game generation will go to college. Like, not the unborn broke kind of stuff, but their kids. That would be weird. Okay, time to quickly finish the last year. At 1am, of course. Okay, we're good now. He has not too bad clothes, but I hoped for something more normal. What could you wear? I guess for now you'll keep wearing what you had. I may change it in the future, but for now it's good. Okay, that's enough for you. Let's move out. Alright, so that's all for today. As you can see, I moved look here in the meantime. Yes, I didn't lock the door. Let's not think about that, I'll do it later. Yeah, he's gonna be like that now. He's in the college as well. And I'm gonna pick his major and everything in the next rotation. So, let's not think too much about it and let's just leave any opinions or suggestions in the comments below and see you next episode. See you hopefully next Wednesday. Bye!